These are people in their prime. These are the people who are moving St. Louis. These are the decision makers that's in the YPN network and then tied to the RBC, which is the big corporate leaders and CEOs and chairmen of these boards. You have direct connectivity to everyone moving this city. One of the things I love most about St. Louis is you can make an impact here. And groups like the Young Professionals Network and Leadership 100 are a great place to do that. The best thing about St. Louis is it's big, but not too big and it's small, but not too small. So it's kind of just the right size for you to find your niche. I like to say St. Louis will make room for your gift. And there is a niche and there is a place for everyone to be here. When I look at the goal of St. Louis and the goal of the region, is A, to figure out how can we bring more young talent here to St. Louis? And then B, how can we ensure that we retaining foreign talent as well. In terms of retaining diverse talent here in St. Louis, the YPN has really you know, hit it out of the park, really given those folks, folks like me, uh, a home, a place to feel welcome. Just opening the city's arms wide to people like me who are not from St. Louis. Attending these events, I was able to meet a lot of people, develop relationships. I ended up on some boards. I think the YPN is so important for the region because there's such a need for connection Almost overnight, I start connecting with people. I start learning how to gain executive presence, how to be a leader. We wanted to be open, we wanted to be accessible, and we wanted to be a place where when people join this organization, they can get in, get active, and get known. For any young professional, I would encourage them to just really get engaged. Reach out. The more that you volunteer, the more that you develop your network, the more you'll find opportunities that are so inclusive. Businesses cannot be successful if the people in the community are not successful as well. And I think the investment in the community will continue to just grow. We gotta make sure we take care of what's happening in our employers, but also getting a connection with each other to move St. Louis. St. Louis is one of those cities that you can really navigate. When you think about being able to take your kids to a park or get them involved in some sporting event or take them to some cultural activity, it has it all. Our aquarium, getting into the zoo, the art museums, and all of these wonderful places are very affordable or even free. So you can work and, and do really well in your job and advance in your career and then also just have a really robust and wonderful lifestyle around that that's very affordable and accessible. There's over $15 billion of construction going on in the region. I see St. Louis as the city that should be invested in right now. I think if we can just attract more talent, people who really have a vision and a passion to invest in this city and kind of stay here and grow their business or grow their company, grow their family here, I think the sky's the limit.